Ok, Chaha very early to tell. Um, he has had hamstring injuries in the past, so uh, he has a pretty good idea when he's in trouble. So, oh, conservatively, it's probably a couple of weeks, which is a bit of a blow. Um, what went well today? Well, we were in the fight. Um, we, we weren't at our best. We were um, probably 10 runs short with the bat, maybe 15 runs short with the bat. Uh, but we hung in there pretty well. We created an opportunity towards the end. Rowett's uh, the over, the, the 19th and ultimate over, was, uh, was pressure-filled and he responded well. Um, but I thought we hung in there pretty well. You're not going to win every game in this IPL, but all I ask is that we're in the fight and compete. And, um, yep, there's some areas we can get better. There's some areas we weren't as good as what we've been, but we were still in the scrap, so it was a good game. Yeah, we, look, we, we've got to be careful that we don't get um, we don't get too carried away by a loss. We've done well up to this point. Guys have contributed well, um, but it is a good time halfway through the tournament just to have a look at what's best. Now, the biggest thing for us is getting to know this this pitch out here. It's not Chennai, so keep in mind that we picked a side that was going to be Chennai based. So we're learning as much as anyone. That's only our second game out there. Um, so we've got to work extra hard for home advantage. So we've learnt a little bit again today, um, and we've only got a day now to make sure we try and get the right combination for, uh, for Delhi. But, um, yeah, we're, we're, we're pouring over teams. Willie is certainly one name that's popping up, but when you're playing well and, and players are doing well, they, they earn the right to play majority of the time. Well, not as much as what we'd like. Um, I think Jadu is uh, right-handers and with good turn, he's, he's, a, he's dangerous. But with Harbhajan and Nimran, we've got a, a luxury of spinning options with the balance of our side. Uh, and the captain obviously looked at Harbhajan's um, performance today and, and Nimran's been a guy he's gone to predominantly. But I, I think probably the seamers were more effective today. Uh, and again, coming back to understanding this ground, that's not necessarily the... Aside, we, we picked, so we just got to make sure we use our resource and, and get an attack that's going to be uh, effective for the next game against Delhi. Yeah, it wasn't true, was it? It was a little bit of a struggle, but in saying that, we were in a prime position. Mitch McLennigan's over, um, where he got away, I guess, with getting MS with a, a rogue one. He might claim that it was a great plan, and it quite possibly could have been, but. That's a turning point in the game. We're set to launch. Um, MS has obviously been in great form in the final overs, so a score of 190 was a real possibility. So for them to bowl well and drag it back to 170 was um, well, it was good cricket from them. But we created an opportunity where we could have pushed on. Again, it just wasn't. Things can happen like that. We weren't far off, but another 10 would have been nice. Oh, everyone's, everyone's dangerous, and probably more so when, when teams are desperate. So Mumbai were desperate today, and, and Delhi will certainly be desperate on Monday. Um, no, no reason to suggest that we're not desperate either, but sometimes when you have some wins, you, you just get a little bit complacent. So finding the balance between confidence and, and making sure you respect the little things is, is, has been a challenge, but not now. Uh, massive changing conditions, naturally. Um, uh, this is just what it is. We, we just got to work out what our best combination is and, and how the nature of the pitch is going to play. So we can't lament not being at Chennai. We can only look forward to playing here. We played a, an excellent first game here um, and we didn't play a bad game today. It was some good play from Mumbai, um, but we still created opportunities and, and that's the positive. It's games where you, you don't fight or, or down and out that you get concerned. Well, one... There's very little grass in Chennai and there's a lot of grass out here. So that's one obvious visual um, difference. But the nature of the bounce, um, the bounce in Chennai is quite spongy. Uh, the side boundaries are quite long. Um, but also here, I had a good experience here, like learning how to use the wind and 
and just making sure that we can read it when there's a bit more grass on how it's going to play. And as was pointed out, it looked a little bit, a little, little bit tricky today. So just making sure we, we, we can find those subtleties and get the right team to play on it. Yep. Yeah, and then Giddy arrived this morning, so it's nice to have him back. Um, obviously, he's been back in South Africa, so he uh, he joined the squad this morning, which is good timing. Yes, um, we're in the middle of a quite a hectic patch. I think we're seven games in 13 days or 14 days. So, yeah, we, we, we have to be careful about how we're travelling. We've got only a day between, so... Um, it doesn't matter whether you're an older player or a younger player. There's, um, with travel as well, there's a lot of energy being spent. So we're conscious of that, and we'll just try and charge the batteries and be as dynamic as we can for Monday. Uh, well, that's not my decision. That's purely MS decision. Um, Shardul has been inconsistent uh, at the death, so we've worked very hard on getting his planning more than anything, um, fields into where to bowl. So we've, we've worked very hard on that. That's still a work in progress. Uh, you've got to appreciate that most teams are struggling at the death because the hitting is so good, so looking to find a, um, a way to shut people down. Um, there's been no better evidence than that in our last few games when we've been batting. So it's a tough skill and it's getting harder. But um, he's made some good games, but there's still an inconsistency there. Um, Bravo, why wouldn't you go to him? And that's why we value him so much, that if he can tie up an end, then, yeah, sure, we need to find a, um, a couple, not just Shardul, but others that can do that job. But we're working hard on that. We realise it's an important area. Um, but the other thing we do is show faith in players. So while there's some gains, just, just chucking players in and out doesn't solve the problem. And that's been one of our methods, is that developing a player and giving him a chance is very important. Uh, and Shard Shardul's been on that path. But, but we'll assess it again um, and make sure the numbers stack up. Otherwise, we'll look to make a change. Thank you. Sir. Thank you.